back to the Night Child Reviews Prince. We're looking at Prince's Graffiti Bridge album from 1990. This is Day 10, Track 10, Tick Tick Bang. Now, Tick Tick Bang was the oldest song to be kind of brought into this project. A lot of these songs were around in the vault for a number of years, but this is the oldest one dating back to 1981. Um, it's actually recorded in the same session as Controversy was recorded. It's quite interesting because um, Prince re-recorded this in 1989 and he changed a lot of the lyrics of the song and there's a bit of a debate going on about whether people preferred the original outtake or they preferred this version but he significantly changed the song. Um, it also has a little Jimi Hendrix sample in it apparently which is, uh, see if you can spot that. This is also a Prince solo effort. Prince does everything, he's playing everything, singing everything, this is Prince you know, on his own. Now. This is the part of the album where we ain't into the kind of two battle songs. The two battle songs from the Graffiti Bridge film are Tick Tick Bang versus Shake, where they have a kind of showdown of who's got the best song, uh, Prince versus the Time. So this is his kind of you know angry, fiery effort. And uh, we we enter this, and it's kind of um, it, Prince is in an angry sense. He's a kind of angry and being sexy at the same time. He wants to prove a point, and so this song just explodes out of the gate. You know, he starts off with this kind of, oh, I just, you know, I can't hold it. Ooh, and it just goes near this bang, 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 bang. And he just got, you know, stuff flying everywhere. Prince's voice is pitch shifted and changed. And he's got this, you know, it's got sped up and slowed down. Um, you've got this very busy drums going on. You've got kind of several layers of drums that just rumble along. You've got these synthesizers that kind of go into this kind of, like, almost like a circular kind of, uh, kind of, a motif, you've got guitars, I mean Prince is throwing everything at this one, you know, you've got some also good, just fantastic uh, guitar stabs, just these little touches of the guitar, and I've often said that Prince can do more with like a two, three second guitar stab than some artists can do in whole albums, you know, it really is just, uh, just remarkable, it really is. Um, anyway, the lyrics are very much like about, you know, Prince can't hold it in, this kind of sexual passion, all these kind of, um, feeling for this woman he talks about you know you're such a bombshell if I ever get you ever get you there's a no telling how long I'd last and he talks about you know uh, you're like a good pill all I need is two and I'm so into you you're the best stuff I could ever get and he kind of he just he's just exploding every five seconds it's ramping up and getting more and more kind of a feisty and full um, he talks about you know I'm gonna be tick tick bang all over you all over you and in the background Prince is kind of chanting you know bang 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 and he just kind of you know, everything's going on in this one. Prince is kind of fired up. Um, it's also a great part, 150. There's a little guitar solo, and it's just really, a really great guitar solo. Really kind of, um, a little bit reminiscent of Elephants and Flowers, a little tiny bit, but it's really, I really enjoy it. It's a really good guitar solo, so 150, check that out. Um, like I say, you've got these synthesizers that swirl around, kind of giving these kind of little uh, motif, like a high, a high note kind of synthesizer, uh, Little, little stabs but I tell you what this is just some of the lyrics are great it talks about like this chain around my hip I want a 24k relationship so baby don't spit me out he goes tick 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 bang um, it's fantastic in the film there's explosions going off there's fire and feist and Prince is just you know kind of trying to prove his point um, I think there's you know in the, in the film it's taken very much as Prince has perhaps gone off script he's not looking at the spiritual he's kind of been seduced by the physical again but this song they would waited so long and it changed so much finally found a place to come out in graffiti bridge and this is what is so great about this album a the kaleidoscope of different ideas of different musical uh, notions of the time of prince of Mavis staples of tevin campbell of tc ellis you know uh, george clinton getting all these different ideas and different musical tastes but also the fact that so many songs had waited to come out you know, I mean, the list is endless, but, you know, joy and repetition, tick, tick, bang. There's so many songs, Wigan Funk, that just waited to have their moment. And this was like, kind of, you know, like it's been said before, but this is also like a kind of one of the greatest hits of the vaults in the sense of not saying these are the greatest songs in the vault, but saying this is, you know, one of the Amps Prince release where he's put a lot of vault material uh, in, you know, on, this, on this album. And it really works so well. But anyway, that's it for Tick, Tick, Bang.